If you have no enemies, you haven't accomplished anything remarkable. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Hello, aviation enthusiasts. Today, we're embarking on an exhilarating exploration of a groundbreaking aircraft that's set to change the skies forever. Join us as we uncover the secrets behind the Bell V-280 helicopter and its remarkable vertical flight capabilities. As technology continues to push the boundaries of what's possible, the aviation industry is undergoing a transformation like never before. The Bell V-280 helicopter stands at the forefront of this revolution, promising enhanced speed, agility, and versatility compared to traditional rotorcraft. Designed with innovation in mind, the Bell V-280 boasts a futuristic tilt rotor design, combining the benefits of a helicopter's vertical takeoff and landing with the speed and efficiency of a fixed-wing aircraft. Let's take a closer look at some of the remarkable features that make the Bell V-280 helicopter a true game-changer in the world of aviation. With its advanced aerodynamics, state-of-the-art avionics, and impressive range, the Bell V-280 has the potential to revolutionize various industries, from military operations to civilian transportation. The future is vertical. Imagine a world where urban transportation is redefined, emergency response times are reduced, and military missions are executed with unmatched precision. The Bell V-280's vertical flight capability opens the door to endless possibilities. As the Bell V-280 soars through the skies, it unlocks new horizons for exploration, adventure, and progress. Its advanced technology and engineering brilliance are a testament to human innovation and the relentless pursuit of excellence. The Bell V-280 Valor is a tilt-rotor aircraft similar to a helicopter aircraft developed by the Bell Aircraft Corporation as part of the American Future Long Range Assault Aircraft Program aimed at providing the United States Army with an aircraft capable of replacing the Sikorsky UH-60 Black Hawk utility helicopters. Presented in 2013 at the Annual Professional Forum and Exposition of the Army Aviation Association of America in Fort Worth, Texas, it made its first flight in December 2017. In December 2022, wins the contract and is chosen by the American Army to replace the Black Hawk as well as part of the attack AH-64 Apache. The Bell V-280 Valor is a tilt rotor, that is, a tilt rotor aircraft similar to a helicopter plane with two turboprops and a V-tail. The two side rotors that can be lowered during flight allow the device to combine the endurance and speed of a small plane with the hovering, takeoff and vertical landing capabilities of a helicopter. Capable of carrying a load of up to 4,500 kg, it can move in transport version at a speed of 280 km per hour for a range of 3,900 km and, in combat version, can reach a maximum speed of 518 km per hour for 1,480 km of radius. It can carry 14 soldiers and their equipment as well as 4 crew members. History On September 24, 2015, assembly of the convertible's first fuselage was completed. This fuselage was sent to the Bell factory in Amarillo where final assembly takes place. In April 2016, the device was crossed, the wing was therefore fixed on the fuselage of the device. On December 18, 2017, the V-280 registered N-280BH powered by two General Electric T-64S made its first flight at the Bell factory in Amarillo. The entry into operational service of the device, if selected, 
will take place in the course of the 2020s, without further details at the present time. On May 17, 2019, the V-280 qualified for the United States Army's Level 1 maneuverability tests. On March 16, 2020, the Bell V-280 Valor and the Sikorsky Boeing SB-1 Defiant Gyrodyne were selected for the final of the FLRAA, Future Long Range Assault Aircraft, the replacement program for the UH-607 as well as a part of the AH-64 Apache Attack Fleet 2. On December 6, 2022, it won call for tender aid for a market that could reach up to $70 billion. Prototype A V-280 Valor prototype in flight at the Alliance Air Show, Fort Worth, Texas in October 2019. In June 2015, Bell's subcontractor Spirit Aerosystems began assembly of the composite fuselage for the first prototype V-280 Valor which was delivered in September 2015. In total, the design and manufacturing of the fuselage was completed in only 22 months. Although the V-280 is initially planned for the JMR demonstration program, Bell does not anticipate much difference between it and a final FVL entry. By January 2016, the V-280 demonstrator was 23% complete, with the fuselage and wings mated together in early May 2016. That the demonstrator aircraft began ground vibration testing in Amarillo in February 2017, with the aircraft reaching 95% completion. The demonstrator was undergoing ground testing in October 2017. Bell released a video on December 18 showing the first flight with the area around the pivots blur. In April 2018, it ran for 75 hours on the ground and flew for 19 hours, up to 80 knots, 90 miles per hour, 150 kilometers per hour, before transitioning to airplane flight by the end of the month. By the end of the month, it attained 140 knots, 160 miles per hour, 260 kilometers per hour, with prop rotors 60 degrees forward, and is planned to reach its airplane cruise configuration with horizontal pylons in summer. It reached 190 knots, 220 miles per hour, 350 kilometers per hour, in cruise mode with horizontal propellers in May 2018. After 155 hours of rotor turn time and 70 flight hours, by October 2018 it had reached 250 knots, 290 miles per hour, 460 kilometers per hour, at 80% prop rotor cruise speed. It was flown to a 45 degrees bank angle at up to 200 knots, 230 miles per hour, 370 kilometers per hour, achieved a 4,500 feet per minute, 23 meters per second, climb rate at 160 knots, 180 miles per hour, 300 kilometers per hour, exceeded 200 knots, 230 miles per hour, 370 kilometers per hour, with less than 50% torque, and recorded a peak load factor of 1.9 g. Its longest flight covered 370 miles, 320 nmi, 600 kilometers, as it performed a ferry flight to Arlington, Texas to continue testing closer to the U.S. Army. After one year of flight tests, it reached its 280 knot, 320 miles per hour, 520 kilometers per hour, target by January 2019, as it will continue to expand its flight envelope, low-speed agility, bank angles, and autonomous operations that I in December 2020, the V-280 reached 305 knots, 350 miles per hour, 565 kilometers per hour, as it was flown for over 200 hours. Design A V-280 in flight with rotors tilted to hover configuration. The V-280 is designed for a cruising speed of 280 knots, 320 miles per hour, 520 kilometers per hour, hence the name V-280. It has a top speed of 300 knots, 345 miles per hour, 556 kilometers per hour, a range of 2,100 nautical miles, 2,400 miles, 
3,900 km, and an effective combat range of 500 to 800 nmi, 580 to 920 miles, 930 to 1,480 km. Expected maximum takeoff weight is around 30,000 pounds, 14,000 kilograms. From its inception to its remarkable flight demonstrations, the Bell V-280 helicopter represents a leap forward in aviation. Thank you for joining us on this captivating journey into the future of flight. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all things aviation. In conclusion, the Bell V-280 helicopter is more than just a machine, it's a testament to the incredible capabilities of human ingenuity. As we look to the skies, we can't help but be inspired by the possibilities that this revolutionary aircraft presents. Whether it's soaring above cityscapes or accomplishing complex missions, the Bell V-280 is poised to shape the future of aviation.